Hello and welcome back to Zeus, Master of Olympus. Okay, so last time we had just completed the first two episodes, I believe. So if I just hit resume adventure, it should bring us straight back to where we were. <clears throat> okay, so I just hit pause. So let's see. We just started a new one, so what we need to do was get a sanctuary to Ares and at least 50 people in residence, so that's the elite housing. Um, okay, so it looks like we've got to set it aside, so we do have enough wheat for that colony. We don't have enough olive oil yet. Um, how's our food situation looking? We've got food stored for eight months, but a lot of that is wheat. I would be somewhat concerned about uh, just getting rid of that. Um... We'll leave it for now. Um, we've still got to get the residency, uh, the residence up and running, and we've also got to get that sanctuary built for Ares, um, which is going to be really cool because it's going to mean that Ares and his dragon is going to wander around our town. And uh, as I said last time, we will also be able to send him on missions, which will be really cool. Uh, so, first thing I'm going to do is get started on the sanctuary. So I think I'm going to place it near the palace, because uh, there's a lot of space there. And I could place it I could place it somewhere out here, but I'd rather keep this area... Oh, there's some more meadow down there, I didn't realise. Um, I'd rather keep this area sort of free for now. So the initial cost of the fortress is 13 marble and 960 drachma. That's not all it's going to cost. Um, that's all it'll cost money-wise, but we'll also have to hire some artisans and we will have to supply it with enough marble, sculpture and wood, I believe that's everything. Um, we'll need all of that to actually get the fortress built. So we'll place the initial foundation, which I think we'll place uh, just here, should be fine. Yeah, and we'll link it up here. So this is the initial foundation, but as you can see it's not complete yet. So what we'll do for that is we'll um, I can't really remember how many artisans I'll need. We will go with four for now. Um, okay, yeah, you can hear the stadium going there. Alright, so what does this need? It only needs 40 slabs of marble, which, to be honest, we should have. 12 loads of woods and two sculptures. Let's have a look. Uh, some sanctuaries take more, like I think the one to Zeus takes a lot of, uh, a lot of material. But the Ares one's quite a basic one. Um, let's see, where were we? Oh yeah, we've got enough marble. We don't have enough wood. Um, we still can't make it ourselves. We can do a sculpture studio, so we'll do that. I'm going to place that over here with the rest of our marble. Um, it needs bronze. Okay, so we're going to have to get bronze shipped in. That won't be an issue. I we'll have another storehouse here, which we will save just for sculptures. And nothing else. Alright, so that's going to be our sculpture area. We've got dudes here that's going to fill that up. We will need to disband one of our uh, one of our little rabble armies. Uh, but I don't think we can do that until it's paused. It won't actually listen to any of our commands, which is a little annoying, but not the end of the world. Um, so, how to get started, really. Um, excuse me. Trying to click that. There we go. Uh, so bronze and wood. Bronze and wood. Um, well, we can't get, make our own wood. We also can't mine our own bronze. So it's going to be a matter of importing it. So Mount Pelion sell bronze. So that won't be a problem. Um, ooh. Nowhere seems to. Ah, okay. Libya sells wood. That's absolutely fine then. Alright, so in that case, we will buy wood. Um, how much do we need? We need 40, don't we? So I think we might just leave it at that, to be honest. Yeah. Oh no, only 12 loads of wood. Okay, well in that case, let's not go overboard. We'll have 16, just we got a little bit sort of backed up. Definitely got enough money for it, so that's not going to be an issue. Um, so yeah, that's the bronze. It was Mount Pelion that do the bronze, wasn't it? Saying that, I could just buy sculpture, but we'll do it the right way. We'll we'll get some imported. Uh, we will. 
bronze is quite expensive. We'll keep an eye on our finances, but for now we'll just get as much bronze in as we can, because I know that we will need bronze for certain parts of the elite housing. Um, so I think what I want to do is I probably want to get Ares up and running before I even get started on the elite housing. I think we'll focus on getting the sanctuary built. Um, just because then we'll have Ares in the town, we'll have some armies that we can actually play with, and that might give us something to do while we're trying to get the elite housing up and running. Um, so yeah, for now, I think we're probably ready to unpause. We'll be importing wood, we'll be importing bronze. We've got a sculpture studio, so it needs bronze to create sculptures, but that won't be a problem. We'll have the bronze being brought in. And uh, yeah, all right, let's hit unpause. What speed were we at, actually? We're at 90, that's probably fine. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. All right, so we need a lot of workers now. So actually, oh, no, we can't do it there. Stick them back there. Oh, how incredibly fortunate. They're just going to give us sculpture. All right. Well, we've been given sculpture, so that's great. So we'll send those guys home. And these guys as well. I know they're keeping the wolves at bay, but we need workers more now. Alright, so how many workers are we going to need now? Uh, you got to wait for these guys to actually get home. Um, so looks like they're bringing the marble. Oh, we were selling marble, weren't we? We probably still want to be selling a little bit of it, just because we've got so much. Same with the fleece, really. Um, okay, so they're actually getting started now, so that's cool. How many sculptures did we actually manage to take in? Um, oh, goodness. Okay, so there's all our sculptures, so we've got enough. We'll sell the excess, to be honest, because we do not need that many sculptures. Okay, yeah, they've just gone everywhere. <laughs> 18 is a little bit overkill, but... So, okay. We've got to wait for Libya to do their thing. Libya will come and buy some of that fleece and drop off some wood at the same time, so that'll be good. Uh, I'm liking seeing all this cheese come flooding in. Definitely needed. Especially if we're going to get rid of the uh, wheat. Right, so here come Libya. There we go, so they're dropping off wood and they're taking the fleece, so that's fantastic. That's absolutely perfect. All right. As soon as these guys get materials, they'll get started. Um, what is it they're waiting for? They're placing marble tiles. Does that mean that marble is on its way? Is this the marble? Who am I, yeah. How much do I have to travel it's going to the storehouse rather than the masonry shop. Interesting, interesting. So. Okay, they're trying to give us bronze now as well. Um. We'll postpone it, and you, you guys can also accept bronze, because they're going to give us gifts, I'm not going to turn it down. Right, we only need nine workers. Uh, is there a way around that? Yeah, stick another house there, why not? Just as a quick fix. To be honest, even if it doesn't get upgraded. I'm wondering why... They haven't been told to go and get that marble, so I'm curious as to why... There we go, so we got the bronze. I'm curious as to why they aren't going to... Ares. Ah, okay, so it was coming from the other storehouse, that's why. So they'll they'll make the trip, even though it is a bit of a long, a long one. They don't care about that, so that's good. As soon as these people move in... Which, yeah, here they come. That should solve our workforce problem, especially when it upgrades. Alright, so there's all the bronze. I don't know if any of this is going to go to the sculpture studio. I'm not sure if that is affected by distances. Oh, that wasn't them. Um, yeah, they may be going to get it. doesn't have enough bronze. We'll keep an eye on that, but to be honest, we don't need sculptures anymore. It's uh, a problem of the past. Ah, yeah, they are. They're taking it down, so that's fine. Alright, so they get the marble and then they start to place the tiles. I like how you can actually see the sanctuary be built. It's not just 
something ticks and then it's suddenly constructed, you get to see them actually build it, which is quite a nice touch. Alright, so these guys are... Because our city's contestants won the last Olympian game... Oh, we're hosting the games! That's so cool! So, I'm guessing they're going to come from here? Yeah. These are the enemy contestants. <laughs> Could we just, like, kill them all off and guarantee that we win? <laughs> Alright, cool, so we're actually hosting the Olympic Games, that's quite prestigious. Um, wood, yes, we will need wood. We have got, we have brought it in though, so that's fine. How much wood do we actually have? We have 12. Alright, we'll stop there actually. We're not going to buy, we don't need to buy any more. I'd rather be making money, wow, there's a lot of people coming in. Yeah, I'd rather be making money than worrying about the wood. Okay, so ah, it needs fleece. So they'll get they'll get what they need. Slowly, there we go. Is this going to upgrade all the way? No, it needs olive oil. Oh, from the looks of it, it doesn't deliver everything to them at once. It only delivers what they need. So until they reach this stage, because presumably, yeah, that guy would have been selling olive oil as well. But I guess they didn't pick any up because they didn't need it yet. So we've got to wait for them to make another trip around before they'll get that, but that's not a problem. Meanwhile, artisans are all working on that. While we're here, maybe we should create a little elite housing district. Yeah, why not? Let's do that. We'll stick it over here. Okay, good. I was just double checking that there is definitely a hygiene guy here because I do not want the fortress to collapse. I would uh, the um, sanctuary to collapse, that would be a disaster, given how much it costs. Um, Alright, so these guys are definitely going to need it to be pretty, so we'll go with that. We'll stick a guy there. And then we need 50. We'll start with a couple and just sort of see how we... Okay, it has to be even more high appeal than that. Um, Okay, there we go. It was just because it was paused, it didn't realise that things had been placed and changed. If we start with two, and then we'll see what we need for that. Cannot evolve until the appeal increases. Well, you say that, but... Yeah, let's put some columns along here, why not? That could look quite nice, maybe? Probably not? I don't know. We'll go with that, see how it goes. <coughs> So this is the actual games taking place now, I guess. It's pretty cool. I'm actually just going to turn my volume down to squidge. City Games End. We came in second. Our citizens enjoyed watching the world-class competitions and our popularity has increased and other cities throughout Greece think more highly of us because of hospitality extended. Fantastic. So there's really no downside to that. So that's good. Um, I wonder if these guys are come here. Okay, they're a little bit lacking in appeal there, so how about an avenue? Oh, that's what I was looking for the other day. A single... Ah, maybe that wasn't there before. It probably was and I just missed it. I was looking for a way to do just one side of the road as a boulevard. Obviously that's out. Alright, you know what? We'll stick a monument right there. That'll increase the appeal. Oh, they're making improvements. There we go. So I actually caught them mid improvement. And I wonder, are these guys going in there? They are. Okay, so these are our houses. There aren't enough cultural pursuits in the area. Well, that can certainly be changed. If we stick a college and. Alright, I do want to keep an eye on our funds. We are rattling through that quite quickly. And a drama school. And we'll see if that changes anything. Alright, what's the residence and... Okay, it's just a slightly different version of it, I suppose. Oh wow, that's all the contestants leaving. We're not importing anything anymore, are we? Oh, we are still buying bronze. Alright, we can stop buying bronze now. Um, yeah, it's costing us quite a bit of money. We'll stop buying bronze. Okay, so this is a residence. Right. 
So that's one, five, this is five each, and we need 50, don't we? So, God, we need 10 of these. Bloody hell. Okay. 38 workers needed, and there's housing for 48 more people. Hmm, concerning. It may not be enough. Um, just thinking where I can pop another couple of houses, if anywhere. Well, I reckon I can fit one there. For now, we can pop one there. I know I wanted to leave that sort of free, but we don't really have... Beggars can't be choosers in this case. Alright, so the wood is now making its way. So that's good. Let's slow down on how much we're buying. Let's still buy, but let's only have 20 at a time. That makes sense. So if there's... 20 there when the trader comes we won't actually buy anything so that's fantastic all right these guys need more cultural pursuits huh okay and more appeal right well, in that case just build a little bit more park around here i don't know if it's going to make any difference gift of sculpture sure we'll take some more sculpture appeal Okay, so they, those guys need armor. Alright. They've got six occupants. Oh, okay, no, I was doing it. So 6, 12, 18, 24, 30, 36, 42. Okay, so we need... S oh, no, wait, we need 50, didn't we? 42, 48. Okay, nine. Nine will be enough. Yeah, nine guys will be enough. Um, so let's do that. Let's go. That needs to be in a high appeal area. If I stick a park there, I don't know if that'll make any difference. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, no. Okay, so we're running a little short on prettiness from the looks of it. So we'll stick some park. It's just a quick fix. Some park around there. Oh, no, that was silly. Is that seriously still not high appeal enough? Alright, well, let's stick a population monument right there then. Surely that's going to make the difference. There we go. And there we go. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So if they each have six in there, that should, should give us a... Uh, enough to meet that goal yeah we've suddenly got 17 well we're actually very nearly done now i have a feeling that once we've set that aside the next mission may be founding a new city because i think that's what the colony is going to be which will be fun but i'd like to use Ares a little bit before before we jump into that all right so now there's a question there is a question indeed. Is that going to give us... I guess that won't give us troops. They haven't got any armour or anything yet, have they? Alright, so these houses that I built... Yeah, we've got plenty now. Alright, yeah. Workforce is pretty much exactly where we need it to be. Um, yeah, you can have some food. Why not? Yeah, I'll, I'll leave setting aside the stuff until the very end, just because I have a feeling that... Uh, once all that wheat is gone, we're not going to be able to feed our people, but, 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 um, if that's the end of the scenario, then it may not matter so much, because we'll be going somewhere else. Now, Pillion regards you more highly, and I think, okay, the Isthmian games have begun. What do they need? 12 slabs of marble and 4 loads of wood, so we're very, very close now. Very close indeed. So there's the wood. Okay, good. So the bronze is being shipped. Come on, I'm excited to see Ares now. Oh, okay, what happened to this guy? He needs access to more culture. Oh, of course, he's on the wrong side for it, isn't he? 
Um, well, let's stick a podium there, shall we? My advice to you is I don't know if that'll make any difference. Is that going to drag them up? It is. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Alright. So these guys are all... They're all moving in. We're very close, actually. These guys may even do it. And, oh, no. <laughs> oh, that's so harsh. We're making them walk past the rich houses to go and live in the poor ones. Although, to be honest, I think the poor ones look pretty cool. 49 qualify. We are very nearly there. Here comes some of the marble for Ares. Or possibly all of the marble for Ares, actually. <clears throat> I probably could have made this a little easier for them by not making them walk around the palace, but... Too late now. Okay, are we... Oh, we're selling marble. Okay, that's fine. I was going to say, I hope we're not... Still. Oh yeah, I forgot they make a massive statue. Right, they need four slabs of marble and four loads of wood. We're very nearly there. So there goes the mar the wood. The marble. Is that the marble? Or is that a sing no, that's a single block. I'm hoping they're not coming. Oh they are. We've got to wait for them to go all the way around. That's okay. Okay, great. So we've done that. We're very nearly there now. Just need four slabs of marble. Yeah, and our employment is actually completely perfect. It could not be better. Everyone who wants a job has a job. And there is no industry that needs extra workers. So once these guys get here. Oh man, here it comes. All right. The God of War is laughing with glee today, tickled by the fact that you have completed a sanctuary in his honour. He has sent a pair of companies of soldiers to defend your city in times of trouble. He has also granted you his dragon, who will smite down any enemies he happens to run across. Ah, oh, yeah. Oh, dear. <laughs> okay, so that will be... Because you need workers. Oh, cool, we can pray to him. What does that do? I forget. Oh, praying to him. Yeah, if you want him to accompany your soldiers. Oh, cool, there's his dragon. Yeah, he'll just, like, wander around now. And there's Ares, who will also just sort of wander around. Come along, my fire-breathing friend. Maybe we can find something for you to attack. So cool. All right. And also, you get these guys. Ares Elite Guard. Which is pretty sweet. So what I'll do is I'll pop them back there. 41 workers needed, housing for 60 more people. Eh, we may not be able to... They may, we not, may not get enough workers out of that, but... I'm not hugely concerned. Um, okay, so these guys love me. Now, I wanted revenge on these guys, didn't I? So I think this shield refers to how strong they are. Now, can I request... Somebody... Who is it? Mount Pelion that loved me, wasn't it? Can't request a strike. I wonder, if I pray to Ares... Ares has heard your prayer and is eager to go to war with your soldiers, so go at the next available opportunity. So that's awesome. Um, so what I think we'll do in that case is... This is the guy who attacked us. We'll go and conquer them. Take those two. We're not going to have any... Yeah. We may not win this, but... I don't really care. I too will respond to your call to arms and go to battle with your men. <laughs> All right. So with these guys and Ares, I'm hopeful. Yeah. So there they go. If we can conquer them, they'll become our vassal, which I just want to do because they attacked us and made us pay money, and that displeased me. So now I wonder, can we sell sculpture to anyone? Because we've got so many of them there. Yes, we can. All right, let's just sell all our sculpture. We don't need it anymore. That is definitely a good idea. I, I reckon they'll fetch a good price as well, sculptures. Oh, yeah, man, we are going to be rolling in Drachma. Lack of housing vacancies. 13 workers needed. Ah, There's probably somewhere I could squeeze another one out, but 13 workers needed is not the end of the world. 
So yeah, all we need to do now is hit those two. But I'm not going to do that until after we've uh, we find out if we were successful. Now they've got two shields, so we probably will fail because we haven't really sent a lot. I don't know what is going on there? There's some kind of glitch. Um, yeah, we'll probably fail. Ideally, we would have upgraded all these, but we can't really because of armor issues. But ideally, we would have had some of our own soldiers as well and sent an overwhelming force. But yeah, it's not the end of the world. So yeah, you can only do it every now and then. I don't know what the cooldown on it is, but if I try it again now or immediately after, he would say no. Gift of wood? Sure. Thanks, Caladon. <laughs> don't know if I should be giving out, you know... I could have gone and conquered my ally, I suppose, couldn't I? They were a bit weaker, but... No, they're our friends, so... Very interested to see how much money we make when the, uh... Traders come through here. Like, that should shoot up. We're actually making a lot of money now, anyway. Is there anyone that we can import food from? Because that is actually... Oh, no, that's not a trading spot. Wood and olives. Olives don't actually count as food, unfortunately. No, there isn't anyone we can buy food from. But that's alright. You conquered Mount... <laughs> Uh, our, our army was victorious at Mount Sirathon, and their leader, Agave, is ashamed. Mount Sirathon is now ours. To celebrate our achievement, you can build a commemorative monument. Oh, and I will. That's right. So they're bitter. <laughs> and they're paying me in wine. I love it. Okay. So that's that done. Now let's stick our big victory monument somewhere. Uh, it was all down to Ares, so we'll stick it right next to the palace. Fantastic. Okay. Now let's set these two aside. I'm quite curious to see. Oh, because we've still got food stored for a month and we've got enough to feed just about. So that's right. Plus, we're done now. We have. Yeah, we've done everything. It takes a few months to tick, I think. Grift of bronze? Sure. I'll take some bronze. Any minute now. Okay, so the food stored has actually gone back up. Ares is shouting for joy over his latest moves, and his Spartai stand guard over your city. With Thebes well protected and in the trustworthy hands of your prideful deputy, Oedipus, it is time to set forth and expand the kingdom. The Oracle at Delphi recommends establishing a city at Sidonia in Crete, though she's hinted that fertile fields and great forests are not the only things to be found there. Okay, yeah, so now we get to go and found a brand new city, which is great. Um, because I was feeling a little bit cramped in this one. I, some decisions I made that I think I probably could have done a little better on. But, oop. Alright, so, yeah, as I... Oh no, so it wasn't Nosos, but it is on Crete. Choose this location. Okay, I think it's having a bit of trouble with the... Uh, the widescreen here, but a rugged and forested land, Sidonia is located on Crete, the gateway to the rest of the world. Choose this location, yes. The people of Crete are wary of you, and an old beggar man reveals the reason. Once a woman was spotted far off our shores, approaching our island on the crest of a giant foamy wave. As the woman drew closer, it became clear that she wasn't riding on the sea, but on the back of a great white bull. The bull deposited the woman on our shores, and Talos, a bronze man forged by Hephaestus, guards the woman night and day. The bronze man guards our island too, preventing invaders from doing us harm. It has been prophesied that a leader from Thebes will come to our island and take this woman from us. We fear that if this leader succeeds, Talos will no longer guard our island. And since you are from Thebes, you might just be the one that will change our world completely. Right, okay. So the goal in this one is going to be 30 planks of wood for the parent city and 30 amp for a of wine. So that's doesn't sound that difficult, to be honest. Ooh. Doesn't seem to like skipping between different sections. All right, so we've got a brand new map now. 
Oh wow, it's a very small one actually. So yeah, we are just on the coast of Crete here. So this is literally all we've got. Oh wow. Got some different levels. That looks quite interesting. Alright, so let's see, we need wine, right? Ah, we can actually grow our own grapes now, and I'm assuming yeah, there's a winery. So we can make our own wine, so that's fine. And a timber mill as well. Now, just because we complete those goals probably won't be sort of the last thing we do here. So I think I'll start with oh no, I need to start with food. I do need to yeah, well we need a workforce. I'm trying to think, where is the best place for a housing district?